So this is another story by the Brothers Grimm, and it's called The Snake and the Three Leaves. And like all stories, this story begins a long, long ago, in a place far, far away, where there was a young man. Oh, I need a young man. Just a young man. Here we go. Now this young man was very brave and very handsome, just like you are. I'm not. You are brave and handsome. Now, this young man, because he was from a very poor family, he went off to join the army. And he went off to fight for a nearby king. He fought with a sword. It was just like that. Now, he was so good at fighting, he almost won the war single-handed, that the king said to him, Oh, we need a king. Who would like to be the king? Which one would be the king? Very big king. You're a very important king. But, yep, the arms in there. Here we go. The king said to you, young man, young man, come here. The king's going to say to you, thank you for your help. Thank you for your help. I offer you, I offer you, the hand of my daughter. Now that doesn't mean he's going to cut his daughter's hand up and give it to him. What it means is, kiss. It, 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 they probably would kiss because it means he's saying, would you like to marry my daughter? Yeah. Now, oh, he just wants to be the king's daughter, the princess. Who would like to be the princess? <laughs> 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 Yeah. He's given three candles. Just sit on them. 
and the first night he lights a candle and he sits watching his dead wife. And the second night he lights another candle and he sits watching his dead wife. And then the third night he lights a candle and he sits watching his dead wife until three days are all gone. And he's just got to sit there. When suddenly he notices, at the corner of his eye, a snake comes crawling along the floor. Just sit there. And the snake stop, stop, goes all stop, the way stop, stop. to his dead bride. And suddenly the young man draws his sword and he chops the snake, chop, chop, into three pieces. And he goes and sits back on his chair. And as he sits there, watching the snake that's in pieces, suddenly, out of the small another snake appears, carrying three leaves in its mouth. And this snake places the three leaves on the body of the snake. And the young man watches the strange snake with the leaves on its body, when suddenly, all the pieces fall together and the snake comes to life again, and the two snakes crawl off into the night. At once, the young man, that's it, he picks up the leaves, and he puts one on the young princess's heart, one on her mouth, and one on her eyes. When the young princess draws a breath, and wakes up! Oh, and the young prince and princess are so happy together. So the prince, the prince, Because he's just used his three leaves to revive his pride, so he takes them with him and he places them in a special pouch. And when they wake up, the young princess, the young princess, goes and meets her father, and her father's very happy. He's a very happy father, because your princess is back. Now, the young man, because He's got these three leaves. He wants someone to look after them. So he gives them to his trusted servant. He wants to be his trusted servant. My shepherd! I can tell you what to do. Now, hold him to the You can be. That's it. Tell him to take your leaves. Look after my leaves. Silly prince. Now, young man, come here. Because you know I'm going to need your sword. I need your sword. No, you need sword. Because. A message was sent by the king. The king sent a message to the young man's family saying he'd been placed into the tomb with his bride. He'd been placed there to die. So your family thinks you're going to die, young man. So he wants to sail off to see his family. So we need a sea captain. Who wants to be a sea captain? Who wants to be a sea captain? Who can be our sea captain? Servant who quickly 
grabs a small boat and rows and rows and rows and finds the body of the drowned man. Pulls him into the boat, so you can Arthur, back in the boat, lays the leaves on the young man's body and brings him to life. Now there's two of them in the rowboat. Stand up, stand up, stand up, stand up. They row as fast as they can. Young man, young man and servant, come here. Row all the way as fast as you can, servant as well. All the way to the king. Yeah. <laughs> 